today we've received a Mtronics gift. Let's see what is in today's bag. Mtronics. Oh. Wow, an M600 Power Marine motor. With all the capacitors and everything you need. Oh, brilliant. The Marine 50 the new TO range. So you can use it's waterproof, shockproof, lipo support, fail safe. Wow, you can use the lipos with this as well as all the old NICADs and NIMIs. Definitely gonna get into this. Let's have a closer look. Nice, very clear instructions. It's uh, 4.8 volt to 12 volt, NICAD 9 may and 3 cell LiPo. Motor limit is 50 amps continuous, 65 amps peak, 2 seconds, 6 volt, 1.5 amp BEC. It's got LEDs, it's 3 RGB, red, green, and blue, and 2 mode programming. Wow, it's Marine 50 specification. Can you read that nice and clear? So no more worrying about uh, messing about with your batteries and the alarm unit. Put that over there. Let's have a closer look at this unit. Wow. It's got uh, the standard, uh, as we call it, Tamiya connector. Which uh, you can cut off and put one of your own on. Uh, same with the push fit connectors. There's one of them, and the power. Uh, there's a nice little switch on there. Good solid switch. There's the other motor connector. And there's the standard RC connector with no fin down the side, so you don't have to cut it off. Like you do with a lot of the other ones, you have to cut the thing off and make it move. That's fine. But, uh, there she is. We get the tape measure to it and figure it out. Or ruler as you'd like to say. So what we got? Maximum 35 mil wide. Yeah, I'd say roughly 35. Talking 40 long. No problem there. And off top mirrored about 11, 12 millimeter thick. Uh, and it's all encased in Good heat sink on the bottom and uh, potted resin for the top. So that's, uh, no problems there. Nice switches on the board for programming. Right there in the corner. It's very small, it's very lightweight as well. Very lightweight. No water cooling needed for this one. Okay. Let's check out this big boy. Oh, now that is a brilliant made motor. Nice simple packaging. Put that down there. Mtronics marine motor with high efficiency, high torque for up to 12 volts. So it says on that. Have a look at the back, give you an overview. Contains three 100 NF monolithic motor suppression capacitors. 
and the instructions how to connect your capacitors as well. It's pretty easy to do that. Very straightforward. Can't go wrong with that. Nothing complicated there. Now I know you're all down to have a look at this one. The replacement for the 540. Oh yeah, no more 7.2 volt drill motors. There's the capacitors that so I'll take to the side. I'll just take them off. There we go, you got three of them. Really straightforward. Bit of tape on the side, you can take that off, it's no big deal, it's not going to damage the motor. It's only sellotape. Then uh, there's the Mtronics power. It's a nice bruiser that one, look at that, that's well made. Really solid. Okay, so let's check out some sizes. So between the holes, looking oh standard 40 550 mounting. You can mount that straight in the place of a 550. No problem. With the cooling jacket on as well, or the metal jacket rather. I'd say about 38 mil, 39 mil. Maybe a bit less, 36, 37, 38. Yeah, bordering 7 to 8. But, uh, length 65 millimeter with the extension as well, 70, and from the tip 80. So that's not bad. You know, you're talking 65 mil there. So. That is a good, heavy, heavy. Well, I wouldn't say really heavy, but well made heavy. It's got really nice. It's a Johnson motor. Real nice. Yep, that is definitely a Johnson motor, that one. It's even stamped Johnson. I don't know if the camera will make that out. Really nice. So there you have it, the new Mtronics Power M600. Will it be any good in our tests? We shall find out. Thank you for watching today's post bag.